Hello YouTube, Spidey here, bring you another video. Just giving a heads up, this is about like the console war of PS4 and Xbox One it has been decided, and yeah. Oh yeah, I will also be making a video on S3, but this is just strictly for the console war thing. We come flat out and say it, PlayStation 1 this time, boys, Xbox lost. Don't get me wrong, the PlayStation 4 sounds like a really, really good console, but it just spent $500 on the Xbox One like six months ago. So it's definitely a big waste of money for me. And I haven't really gotten much out of it. To be honest, I've gotten like $10, maybe 20 bucks tops. What I mean about the money though is that I've gotten like $20 out of just tourneys on the Xbox One, stuff like that. My personal opinion, do I think the PS4 Switch was a good idea? I don't know, man. I just, I, I'm gonna have to buy a new scuff. At least the scuff is like 30, maybe like 20 bucks cheaper because I already made my scuff and I was just, I wanted to see how much it was. At least it's a little cheaper than the scuff one. And then I got, I got to get a new console. Hopefully I'll win this local I'm going to like next month and uh, hopefully I can win that and buy my PS4, maybe go ahead and get my Scuff 4 or PS, whatever it's called. I don't even know what it's called to be honest. Sony did a great job through presentation at E3. Xbox and Sony had their, um, they had their press conference today and they both did a really, really good job. So, you know, congratulations on that. And congratulations with the exclusivity Sony for Call of Duty Black Ops 3. I'm just pretty happy I didn't pre-order Black Ops 3 for the Xbox One yet, so I can go ahead and pre-order that bad boy for the PS4. Something else I thought though was pretty interesting, I just found out that Xbox One doesn't actually have LAN, it's like simulated LAN, so it's still on the internet, Parasite tweeted it out. So, you know, you'll finally get to see real LAN on the PS4, and I'm really excited to see PS4 on LAN during like the first Black Ops 1 tournament. I think it's going to be really interesting to see. I just gotta get used to the controller. I know it's a lot smaller. I have big hands. I gotta get a new scuff. It's just all this stuff, man. I may or may not double upload today, but I don't know. I'll try and double upload. You know, have my thoughts on E3 and this video, the Contour thing. I think it'll be a pretty cool thing to do. Contour plus E3. E3 was really good. It was really good. I think uh, there's more Black Ops Intel today, Black Ops 3 Intel today. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of people are complaining about this switch to the PS4. Just because people bought Xbox Ones this year, got it for Christmas or something, you know, got it maybe even a month ago. J maybe they even got an Xbox One just so they could play Black Ops 3. And then now, yeah. That happened. So that was a waste of money for a lot of people. And I, I feel the same way, man. I've only had my Xbox One for about like six months. Even the scuff and everything. I, I gotta get a new scuff. I can't play with that scuff. Like, I tried to play Minecraft and I'm sitting here trying to hit the paddles. And it's just, it's bad. It's really bad, guys. Specs, hardware, just controller. Everything is probably better on the PS4. I mean, there's a touch screen pad thingy on the controller. That's freaking sweet. I even heard there's like a mix app on the controller. Like, you can't beat that. Not gonna lie, I really like the Xbox One controller, but you just can't beat that. Like, you you can't, man. Trust me, you can't. I'm gonna miss the Xbox One, though. I really like it. I, I don't understand why so many people hate on it. I actually quite like the Xbox One. I like this whole Windows 8 theme they got going on. I like it. I like this. Okay, the snapping is kind of stupid because I'm in game and then it just snaps and... That's not very cool, I'm on a two bar. But still, you know, I don't know man. There, I think a PS4 is gonna be a good change, but it's gonna be a lot of money, you know what I mean? Yeah, something else, they don't even have scuff grip on the PS4, I'm like, what? You gotta use pro grip? Dude, pro grip sucks, I'm not gonna lie. Pro grip, it makes your hands really sweaty, and it sucks. Scuff grip is the way to go. See, with my, the scuff I have, I had, um, I just had the pro grip and scuff grip, you know how it has a little handles thing? It comes with Pro Grip originally. Yeah, no, you want to change that. I ended up taking these Pro Grip things off, putting Scuff Grip on them. Scuff Grip, amazing. Literally the bomb diggity. It's, it's Scuff Grip is so good, dude. My hands don't sweat. Pro Grip is like leather. It's like rubber or something like that. I don't even know. I, I don't know what I'm saying. But still, like, it just makes your hands really sweaty. Pro Grip sucks. And that's all you can get on the PS4 scuff. And I'm like, what? 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 If you guys did enjoy this video, leave a like, subscribe, follow my social media links from the description below. It's been Jalen, guys. Peace out, everybody!